Hey you guys, good morning. So it is about 10 o'clock in the morning on this beautiful Saturday in Florida. And if you are new to this channel, my name is Lynn. And if you are new, make sure you subscribe to our channel down below. It's that red button down there. And if you are already part of me and Chris YouTube family, welcome back. And if you um, haven't already, make sure you like this video. And so I simply just wanted to tell y'all what we're doing today or what me and Everly are doing today. <laughs> um, we are going to Fuji Sushi to celebrate my one of my girlfriend's birthdays or kind of like a late birthday because her birthday already passed but she was out of town. And so we are going to go eat sushi because she loves sushi. Um, I'm okay on sushi wise, like I'm not really a sushi fanatic, but since I am pregnant, I'm gonna eat the fried sushi, but you'll see once you keep watching. <laughs> and I know my hair is a little out there. I curled my hair last night because I couldn't sleep. And I will be giving y'all a updated bump video or updated like, you know how I've been doing this whole week type deal. I know if you haven't seen my other video, my 25 weeks video, I will link that down below and also my 24 week slash deployment life update because my husband is on deployment as of right now. So I will link both of those videos down below. So make sure you go check those out and give those some thumbs up and just make sure you stay tuned to see what else we do after sushi or I'll see or I'll actually show y'all what I'm eating basically <laughs> and yeah so hope you like this quick little video and if you aren't already following my personal Instagram make sure you go check that out I'll put it on the screen I'll put it down here make sure you go follow my personal Instagram and I will show you a little bit of Timo Taro later just because uh, Courtney who were celebrating her birthday. Courtney and her husband are about to pick me up at around like 10.30 or so. And so we can make it on time uh, for sushi when they open. Yeah, I'm gonna give you updated information on Everly later on after sushi, whenever I come home and settle down. And But it's very nice outside. It's very hot, it's very humid. So as you can see, I am wearing a dress and i don't know dresses are like my safe haven when it comes to being pregnant and it's being it's really humid in florida right now and it's so hot like there's no wind at all Ugh. all i know is i better say stay hydrated that's all i know <laughs> all right so make sure you stay tuned watch me and everly devour some sushi and get chunky a little bit more and just stay tuned. Because my girl is turning 24, or she's already 24 because we're celebrating her birthday late. Um, I usually do this where I buy these balloons. Yeah, I buy these balloons, these big ones from Target and I blow it up and give it to them and they could just take home. But I don't know, I just always liked it, liked it. I always liked the big concept of the big balloons and taking pictures with them. They're really, really adorable. But seeing a pregnant person blow up those balloons by myself, that shit was a struggle. Like, I have blew it up with my little sister or she was on FaceTime and I was blowing it. I was so out of breath being pregnant and having to blow up those balloons. So, it's with love. <laughs> and dedication that I blew those up by myself so kudos to me <laughs> a little early still for Courtney and Walker to come pick me up I wanted to show y'all my outfit of the day this dress I got from forever 21 it is the sea foam color yeah sea foam color this is a medium size I could have gone with a small but I wanted to buy dresses that will let me have more comfortable room whenever she everly gets a little bit bigger and so here's an updated bump i am about 26 weeks tomorrow and yeah baby girl is getting bigger and bigger as you can tell but 
Um, I will be wearing some white flats as well. I just wanted to show y'all the dress that I am wearing. Get the beautiful birthday girl. And Walker. Going to Fuji Sushi. Good thing Lauren came earlier, so we're going to... Well, we're already sitting down, or they already got the table. Fuji Sushi 3! <laughs> Courtney's like, uh, I don't want to be in the way. Look at Lauren. Kaden, say hi. Oh, he's busy. Hi, <laughs> AJ. Cold Creamery. Cold Stone Creamery? We are gonna go treat. Go get a sweet treat because birthday girl wants a sweet treat and I can't say no to sweets because I'm pregnant and Jackie. <laughs> Everly wants sweets too so we're down to get some ice cream. This is our first time. I'm gonna go try it out. So we just left Marshalls and TJ Maxx and I'm gonna show y'all what I bought for baby girl whenever I get home. And stay tuned. We're gonna go watch watch. We're gonna go eat some ice cream. Don't tell Chris. <laughs> Back from eating ice cream with Courtney and Walker, which was bomb. And now Everly right now is kicking like crazy because when she eats or whenever I eat sweets, she's always kicking because she's hella hyper. So let's move on to what I got from TJ Maxx and Marshalls for Everly. And I've been doing this thing where I would go there and only buy the clearance outfits, which is under maybe like, I try to get the outfits under $5 because I know eventually she'll grow out of it. But they're so cheap, so I was like, eh, I'm gonna get it. So I got this from TJ Maxx. It's just um, a, this is for, I got this for $3. I don't know if you see the red tag. Yeah, I got this for $3, regular price, $8.99. This shirt, it says not a morning person, which I'm pretty sure she's gonna be like her daddy and don't like morning at all. <laughs> he could sleep all day, every day if he could. But, and it also came with this uh, plain white onesie. And so I thought, why not? And this is for the size, let's see, six to nine months, which I'm pretty sure she will fit. Definitely got that, and I also got this outfit from TJ Maxx, which was really weird because this outfit, it's um, a like it's a one piece, and with this outfit, it is the three to six month size, which was really weird because, um, and I did get it for, I don't know if it's gonna focus. But I did get it for $4 and regular price $7.99. What I was trying to say was that it's really weird because this outfit, they had other sizes, which I've been trying to aim for six months or six to nine months or bigger because I have enough smaller size outfits for her. But for some reason, these sizes, the exact same outfit for a bigger size, like the six to nine months or even bigger than that, was all was back to regular price it wasn't even on clearance so i don't know why only the three to six month one was only four dollars so i just took the three to six months and we'll just pray that she can fit into it once she is to that size and i really liked it this onesie because um even though it's a onesie it does clip out from the bottom so if i here's the back side you can see so basically, if I need to change her diaper or anything like that, it'll be easier to just uh, unbutton from down here instead of having to take the whole thing off, kind of like a romper type deal. And so I thought that would be really cute. So these is what I got from TJ Maxx. And these super cute outfits are from Marshall. And look how cute. So I got this. This one piece, 
for $4.50. Trying to make sure it focuses. But it's super cute. Look at it. So this size, it is six to nine months. So I made sure that I got bigger sizes. Um, I did see a bigger size for nine months and up, I think. And I was going to get that one. But like I said, for some reason, it wasn't on clearance. And this size was. So I just grabbed this one. And it was really cute. I could probably just put like a little bow on her head. And it'll match. And I really like because it has the little gold uh, foiling on there. Which is really cute. That was one size. Or one outfit. Here is the other cute outfit. It has like little cute little tulips on there. This is six to nine months outfit. Which I'm pretty sure she'll grow into like before nine months. But got this for $4 on clearance as well. And it is a onesie. See with this one it doesn't have any opening at the bottom. But it does have buttons in the back. But I just really thought it was super cute like look at the little faces on the tulips it's so adorable so i had to grab this one and then i bought one more outfit from marshall's i thought this one was the most adorable one and here it is i bought this for four dollars as well I'm trying to make sure it focuses and I really liked it because, you know, if she has, like, chubby arms, then I know she can fit this. And look how cute. Even though it's kind of giving me, like, spring vibes and things like that, I think she'll pull it off regardless. It is super cute. But this one does um, have buttons at the bottom, so it'll be easier for me to change her diaper if need to. And so that is my little small haul I got. I did get my Fashion Nova haul package. Hashtag not sponsored. I did get it in the mail a couple days ago and I will be uploading the fashion haul probably next week just because this video will be up for this week. I'm trying to aim to do a vlog or upload every Saturday is what I'm kind of seeing the consistent consistency of is me uploading one video every saturday so make sure you like this video and um stay tuned to or for next week stay tuned for the fashion nova haul that i'm gonna be trying on all the outfits that i have purchased and i do want to do a quick update on baby girl everly so right now she is definitely kicking because <laughs> courtney and walker took us to go eat ice cream and so like I said earlier in the video, I will be 26 weeks tomorrow and she will be the size of, or it says she'll be big as kale. So it says on this app, which is the bump app. I don't know if it's focusing or not, but yeah. It says that she will be about 14 inches and 1.68 pounds. And it does say that she, her eyes are forming and the eyes will soon start to open and her eyelashes are now grown too. As of right now, I do have to say lately for the past couple days, um, or I say last week. Last week it was kind of hard for me to sleep. I don't know if it's because she's gotten a little bit bigger and the way I was laying throughout the night, it's harder for me to breathe. But now, for the past couple of days, I have been sleeping on top of another pillow. That kind of gives me like a little more, like, kind of an angle to breathe a lot better. And I do sleep on my sides. Uh, I feel I'm more comfortable on my right more than my left. But it says that it's healthier for the baby and for myself to sleep more on my left. And just as long as I'm on my sides, that's all that matters. Uh, I have noticed that. I have noticed last week I was really tired for some weird reason. Just throughout the day, I do get tired, but I try to work through it, you know, just pace myself type stuff, not try not to overdo it. And uh, I think that's the only changes as of right now. I have noticed that I've always had 
kind of like an increase in uh, vaginal discharge, which I know TMI, but it is a pregnancy update vlog. But yeah, throughout pregnancy, I have always had vaginal discharge and it's just regular, it comes normal, comes with the whole package basically. And um, I have noticed that my belly is getting bigger and bigger, as you can tell. <laughs> Once you turn on the post notification bell so you know when's the next time I upload my next video or which I will be uploading my Fashion Nova haul next week or next Saturday. So make sure you be on the lookout for that. And I hope you have a good weekend. And me and Everly are about to call it a day and go to sleep. And I will show a little bit um, of footage of my boys, Team Montaro. Make sure you go follow their Instagram, of course, as well. If you do love corgis, which I'm pretty sure everybody loves corgis. I'm closing out this video. Make sure you like this video down below. And make sure you check out the other videos. I will make sure I link my 25 and my 24 week pregnancy update as well down down below make sure you go check it out and also make sure you follow my personal instagram i'll put the link down there or you know my name somewhere down there somewhere on the screen and i think i'm gonna call it a day just because it's already 321 and so i'm pretty exhausted me and the girls we walked around and you know kind of walked out all the fuji sushi that we intake and um you know i think i'm just gonna relax take it easy you know try not to do too much just because it's super hot outside and it's humid <laughs> and you could definitely get a heat stroke especially being pregnant out there and it's so crazy. All right, just wanted to say bye from Team Montaro. Make sure you go follow their Instagram. Yeah, make sure you go follow their Instagram. Huh, Timo? Sit. Timo, sit down. Mm. <laughs> They're just sniffing all over me right now. But Tara wants to say bye. Say so like the video and follow our Instagram. Right? <laughs>